Hello everyone, I'm Ivy and this is my updated lesson plan. The topic is short story writing. I have uh, since this lesson plan is designed for intermediate level, I'm not being particular about a topic uh, that they need to write their short story on. They are given freedom to write short story based on a set of topics given uh, by the end of the lesson. So it's a 90 minute lesson and uh, of course I'll be focusing on writing skill here and the methodology uh, methodologies are task based language teaching and direct method where I'll be actually explaining the topic to the students and the approach is engage study and activate learning objectives are by the end of the lesson students will be able to express themselves creatively through the creation of short dialogues and captions in canva meme generator develop short stories in microsoft word online from prompts provided by teacher in paired writing exercises use topic related vocabulary provided by the teacher to create stories with clear beginning middle and end in boom writer so while we had peer review I have not received any negative feedback or any areas of improvement that I need to uh, work on in my lesson plan. So I only received positive feedback where they have told me to uh, continue with my lesson plan as they felt it more interesting. And the only thing I have changed in my lesson plan are the two text tech tools the first one is storyboard that which i have replaced with canva meme generator and the second one is google docs which i have replaced with microsoft word online and these are my teaching aids after that let's move on to the stages of lesson first one is engage phase where it is some warm-up activity i will greet my students and then briefly explain the learning objectives with them because i think it's really important for the students to know the learning objectives because it helps uh, them to have an idea about what they are going to learn in that particular lesson and how is it important to them after that i will introduce my first tech tool which is canva meme generator I have replaced uh, this uh, app uh, or I have replaced my previous app with this one because it's more fun and user friendly and after that I will provide link to Canva meme generator and students will be divided to different pairs and each pair will create uh, memes in Canva that best describe their school life experiences. They can incorporate dialogues, caption, humor, their personal experiences and other things in their uh, memes. And I will remind students to use appropriate and respectful languages in their creations. After they are done with their memes, they can download their memes and upload it in Google Classroom. And each pair will present their memes in front of class. After that, it's introduction or the activate uh, stage where I will activate their prior knowledge on the topic short story writing by asking a few questions about their favorite short story writer, <clears throat> their favorite short story, then uh, their previous experience of writing short stories and their favorite themes in short stories such as humor, then scary or else what are the elements of short story writing after that i will introduce the topic and then it's the study phase for 30 minutes where i will explain the topic short story writing using different teaching aids and i will also explain different elements that they need to keep in mind in short story writing such as character plot setting theme conflict and dialogue after that, I will also explain about different kinds of sentences that they can incorporate in their short story, such as imperative, interrogative, exclamatory, and statement. And I will also uh, explain about the format or different steps in short story writing, such as title, uh, proper beginning, middle, and end. So then I will provide uh, a link to sample short story uh, short stories. So these are short stories written by favorite authors such as Roald Dahl. And then I will summarize the points. After that, uh, there is a short break for five minutes and it's engaged phase where they actually practice short story writing so this is my uh, here is here is where i'm using my second tech tool which is microsoft word online so i can share a link to microsoft word online with my students it's a shared link where every students will be uh, able to uh, access to the link and i will provide a prompt 
uh, for example hidden among the clutter of an old bookstore lily's finger brushed against a peculiar looking machine and likewise i will provide a prompt and students work together in pair and they will respond to the prompt they will discuss ideas brainstorm together and they will complete the story so after that the students will submit their response on the shared microsoft word online document and all the students will be able to see each other's work and each group will present their story in front of the class. So here is the evaluation phase or the feedback where as a teacher, I will provide them with constructive feedback on uh, each group's presentation. I will explain about areas of improvement or what they have to focus more on next time when they are writing a short story. And I will provide feedback based on grammar, their vocabulary, their thinking, critical thinking skill and appropriate use of elements and structure of short story, which I have discussed during uh, the study phase. After that, it's the assignment, which I'll be taking 10 minutes to explain to them. Here I will introduce my third tech tool which is Boom Writer. Here uh, I will be giving a set of topics for them like life, nature, adventure, friendship and they have freedom to select any topic according to their interests and preferences and they have to write a short story of 100 to 150 words in Boom's write, Boom Writer and I will advise students to make use of word bank provided by the teacher. So in Boom Writer, we have an option where we can provide some uh, word bank for the students, which will help them to write their story. And after that, uh, uh, after completing their story, they can publish it in Boom Writer. So uh, uh, there is an option for peer review uh, where the teacher will provide rubrics less, such as the elements and other structures which they need to check. Uh, after that, um, they can uh, the students itself, the peer itself will select the winners like the first, second and third prize. So it's based on the rating. So whoever got uh, uh, the maximum rating, they will be the winner. So um, uh, they will explain the three best stories which will be selected based on ratings provided by peer. So he can here we can see see. So based on rating, uh, the student uh, the best stories will be selected like this. So that's the end of the lesson. So I will give all the instructions to them. And then it's five minutes for them to wrap everything up. I hope my lesson is uh, interesting and um, innovative. Thank you for listening. Have a great day.